In this video we will test uh, GT1030 and find uh, how many Z cache solutions per second can provide. As you can see GT1030 uh, has a very low power consumption uh, maximum, the maximum TDP is 30 watts and uh, let's uh, find uh, how how we will perform ok with the stock walks of the card uh, in the first iteration we get uh, 56 uh, solution per second uh, I will overclock the card uh, after a while ok uh, on the second iteration uh, now we get uh, 52 solutions Mm. Now let's try to overclock a little bit the card. Maybe maybe 150 maybe 200 for the 250 for core clock. And let's clock the memory. 300 let's uh, try the performance now okay the view car card is clocked now uh, we get uh, 5452 with uh, the base clocks uh, now with this clock uh, we will see the performance Ok, let's try the next iteration Again, uh, 50, As you can see, uh, the average uh, solutions with the base clock are um, around 54 solutions per second. Uh, with this clock, uh, after we clock the card, uh, we get uh, 57 solutions per second, uh, which uh, is not uh, a big difference. Uh, and that's it. Uh, thank you for watching.